Hi, I'm Lou with another episode of My Car Story. And today we're out in Chicago at the Collector's Car Garage at the Rise and Drive Car Show. You gotta come on out sometime and see the great cars that are here first Sunday of the month during the summer in Illinois. You'll enjoy yourself. And I'm with Ken. Ken, good to see you. You too. What's your last name? Kales. And Ken Kales has a great car that you brought here. I, I have to say, I've never seen one. Well, it's the first one I ever saw. It's a Sunbeam Talbot, made in England, 1954. It belongs to a customer of mine. I have a car repair shop and we do restoration and repair on old sports cars. And this, is, do. and this is a great old sports car, so let me grab the camera. And just once again, I want to make sure we have 1954... Sunbeam Talbot. Some Sunbeam. people say Talbot, but mostly Talbot. Talbot, okay. And, and All right, let's take a look at the featured attraction. Sure. Come on right alongside. So, when your customer, first of all, we appreciate him letting you bring this car to the show, when you see this car come into your shop, what's the reaction? I mean, especially when it's a car that you've never seen before. Well, it's, it's unusual, but it's, it's still British, and it's, uh, you know, it's a repairable car. There's a club, and there's, there is some support for the car around the world, and uh, it's a little difficult to get parts, but so far we've managed to get everything. The owner takes very, very good care of this car, well, it's, and it's he owns a number of other ones very similar to this as well. It's spectacular. Looks just spectacular. Let's take a look at it from the side. What's the um, what's the reaction of someone when you're driving this to the show? Well, everybody looks at it. They don't know what it is. They think it might be a Rolls Royce or Bentley or something like that. Or yeah. Mercedes. I mean, these were unusual cars in their day. It's not like they made a lot of these. Most of them. This is an unusual car because it's a left-hand drive car, so it was imported to the United States, and it's a drop head or convertible, which is also not very common. Most of them are sedans. And with the two-tone colors, I mean, the car really looks luxurious. And these are the turn indicators. Those are trafficators. Trafficators. Thank Quite you. honestly, I, I believe they work. I'm not sure I know how to make right. them operate. That's all right. <laughs> Let's take a look at that. Very well played. Let's take a look at the uh, interior, can we? Can we open that up? Yes. No, the, uh, what, is that, uh... That's the, the trunk, the boot, the as boot? they call it. Unfortunately, there's a cover in here, yeah. but, you know, it, it opens that way, which is kind yeah, of Yeah, that unusual. is unique. Okay. All right, we'll close that up. All right. That is unusual. Usually it opens from the bottom to the top. Right. That's a large door. It's a large thin. door. Let me see, so, so the side for a second. Thin door, but large. I mean, uh, wonderful, looks like leather inserts in the car. And you can see the ST on the... Uh, Dash. And a wonderful interior. Very nice. Let's uh, can we open the uh, engine compartment? So different, right? Coventry radiator. Wow. It's amazing. Alright, let's uh let's start her up. We'll hear a little idle noise. Then we'll
just a slight red. That's wonderful. All right, let's sit her down. Boy, is she quiet. She's a very good runner. I'm trying to get that badge that most people may never see. <laughs> the owner will be able to see it maybe for the first time. I'm sure he knows it's there. I'm sure he knows it's there, but I'll actually be able to read it. <laughs> well, Ken, thanks for bringing an amazing car out to the show. You're welcome. Thanks for being on the channel. Thanks for being on my car store. Thank you.